YouTube, what's going on? In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can turn your iPhone, iPad, or Android into a real life projector with this app called Projector App. Yes, this is not bull crap. This is 100% real. And I'm gonna show you guys how to get it here today. It's gonna be completely for free. I will be doing this on an iPhone. You don't need a jailbreak. You don't need to go to some shady website. This is not on the Apple store, obviously. This is kind of some hidden tech. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to get this here today. You don't need a computer. And yes, this does work on Android as well. So what we're gonna do is show you guys how to get the Project app right now. So I'm gonna turn on my screen recording. All I want you guys to do is simply follow along. Um, and as you guys can see here, like I showed before, we're gonna get this projector app just like that. And then you can go ahead and turn it on and I'm gonna run you through what to do. But what we're gonna do here is install it so you can start projecting on the walls anywhere. Obviously, um, newer phones will have better lighting and better visibility on the walls. If you have old phones like this kind of one is, it's not gonna project that well. Um, but if you have an iPhone or Android in the last three to four years, it's gonna be really good. So um, let's go ahead and show you guys how to get it. We need to go to this website called nowplugins.com because it's basically a plugin for our phone. So what we're gonna do is type into this website, www.nowplugins.com. So N-O-W and then P-L-U-G-I-N-S.com, nowplugins.com. Once you guys are here, you're gonna be on the Now Plugins website. It's gonna be a list of plugins. And what you wanna do is just find the Projector app or you can just type it in here, Projector. And you're gonna see Projector app for iOS and Android. Should look like this. And it's gonna say your iPhone or Android in whatever version you're on. Just press Install Now. And this is basically gonna go and connect to your device and basically install the Projector app to your phone. It really is that easy. It doesn't need um, any help regardless of this. You just go ahead, press install, it's gonna install. Now, some people will say um, they're having issues. The reason why you're having issues with this is if you have background app refresh turned off on your phone, um, that can actually stop this from installing. So after this, I've shown how to install it. I'm gonna go and do that little troubleshooting bit just to show you it's super easy to turn on and it is default for every single iPhone and Android that it is on. Um, so you, most of you guys should be okay, but if you're having trouble, that might be the problem. Okay, so as you guys can see, what it's gonna do is take you to this page right here called Plugin Installer. Two of these additional plugin files need to be installed for your plugin to install. Pure VPN, Family on, you biggie. These, all these change like every single day and you'll get different ones if you're on Android, but all you need to do is you need to read the instructions on these. You need to complete at least two of them. They're completely for free and I'm gonna show you guys basically what to do. So these are gonna be apps off the Apple Store or Google Play Store depending on what device you're on. So as you guys can see, this one, it says Ubiggy. It says go ahead um, and get the Ubiggy app off the App Store. So make sure you're clicking it through that link. Okay, don't go search it for yourself. Um, and then you just press download. It takes you exactly to the app, okay? It's that easy. You just press download. Um, and it's basically allowing you to install the app um, through the Apple's third-party software, same with um, the Android store as well. So it's basically installing it through these apps um, and allows you to go ahead and do this. Now there's also one like this where it says Pure VPN. It says go ahead and get the Pure VPN app. So what you do is you go ahead and get the Pure VPN app. It's super easy, you press that. I've actually got a, already got that one. So you make sure you, you, you go ahead and get it. Um, there's other ones like this where it's like Family Island, Go ahead and get reach the level 11 in the app. So what you do is you open it up, get the family on app and get to the certain level. It's super easy. Make sure you're reading these instructions on these guys, but it really isn't that hard. Um, and then you should be all good. Once you've completed those, you're gonna see this new app called Projector App. And now you have basically got it. It's that easy, it's free, and it doesn't take too long at all. So I hope you guys enjoyed and turn on like that and it'll go ahead and turn on, it's that easy. Um, let's go ahead and show you some of the troubleshooting tips here. So if you guys are having trouble with this working, come over here to, or just go to the search at the top, they have search now in settings, and type into background app refresh. You need to make sure this is turned on, like I said, it's default for every single iPhone and Android, um, so make sure that's on. And the only reason is if you, that is turned off, well, most reason is, is low power mode. So if you have low power mode on, this will turn it off. So make sure you guys don't turn on, have low power mode off and have background app refresh turned on and you can get the projector app. Thank you so much, guys. See you guys in the next video. Peace out.